Ladies and gentlemen, Sally Ford and the sound outside. How are you guys doing? Oh, good. How are you? This is kind of a big day for you guys, isn't it? Yeah, it's our record release. I know. Your record's out today. Congratulations. Oh, thanks. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> Produced right here at Jackpot Studios in Portland. Yep. How fun was that to be able to put it all together right here in your hometown? Oh, yeah. It was great. Yeah. Yeah? <laughs> I mean, we have great studios. It doesn't make sense to go anywhere else. Yeah. That's the truth, huh? So you guys are at the Wonder Ballroom Friday night and Saturday night. Anybody here going to the concert this weekend? Woohoo! I'm going. It's going to be a party if you're going to be there. We'll grab a beer. It'll be great. How? When was the last time you guys played to a, a Portland crowd? Uh, I think it was like September or something. Yeah. Are all your buddies coming out? Yeah, always. <laughs> <laughs> coming out to show some love. <laughs> it's cool. It's nice having your friends and random people from the past show up and yeah. watch me play. <laughs> it's a built-in crowd. You don't yeah. need more than that. <laughs> That's awesome. So um, now introduce the gentleman behind you, if you would. Please introduce the sound outside to yeah, us. Yeah, yeah, that's Tyler Tornfelt. <laughs> that's Ford Tennis. That's Jeff Munger. <laughs> How did you guys all come together? Oh, we just met, I met these guys, uh, they're Alaskans, um, Tyler and F Ford, and I met them just through some friends, and they had already been playing music together for a long time, and then I met Jeff when he was busking on the street. He used to do a lot of that on, like, Alberta for last Thursday, and, yeah. You just walked by and said, hey, that's my sound, let's do this. <laughs> I don't know. He was just like, he had even longer hair than, he's growing it out again. But when I met him, he had, yeah, curly, frizzy hair, and he was like singing country songs, and he was, I don't know, he was singing crazy, and I just <laughs> talked to him, and we became friends, and yeah, he didn't join the band till later, when I realized he had a secret weapon of playing the electric guitar. Fabulous. So now, Sally, your voice has been compared to Ella Fitzgerald and Billie Holiday. What was that like for you when you heard that? Um, I mean, I guess I've always wanted to play like or sing kind of jazz blues style or that's what inspired me to start playing music. And that's cool. I mean, yeah. I guess it makes sense. <laughs> Did you grow up listening to them? Uh, sort of. Yeah. Some like Aretha Franklin is more what we listen to and like okay. uh, Etta James. I really like her. Right on. Now, I also heard that there's possible influences of Snoop Dogg in your sound. Have you read that, or is that just a rumor on the internet? <laughs> oh, that was, no, that's because back when MySpace was big, we said our influences were Snoop Dogg. I forget what. It was like something random, just because so I didn't care. And then everybody says it brings it up in interviews all the time, actually. Really? <laughs> well, that's what happens. You're going to put it out there. You know what? That stuff sticks around forever. But yeah, I guess we have like the dirty rawness, the <laughs> naughty language. Well, I cannot wait till Friday night then. You guys are... <laughs> oh yeah, because we have to be edited today. Yeah. Eh. Yes, actually. Sort might, of. Uh, sort of. <laughs> as best as your, of your ability as artists, we'd appreciate that. But we want you guys to have fun here in the Bing Lounge today. And thank you again for coming out and performing with us. And congratulations. The new album is called Untamed Beast. It is out today. Congratulations, you guys. Enjoy and catch them Friday and Saturday night at the Wonder Ballroom. Sally Ford and the sound outside. Woo!